I was born into a Protestant family, actually. You know, my grandfather's an orange man, but he met a woman down in Cork, and she was a Catholic. And when they got married, she demanded that their children be brought up Catholic. Otherwise, my life would be different from what it would be now, you know. I'll put your name down, I'll get you up here with me. So I was all oh, brilliant. Two days later, he was shot dead, not too far from here. Shot six times in the face and the head by loyalists, murdered just from being a Catholic up here at the time. So with Bloody Sunday and the murder of my friend James, it was me Phoenix were here. And I decided what my brothers were trying to do all the time, make me join the Republican movement. You know, and I decided that was the only way to change things here, to join the IRA. After a few months of training and learning things, I started to change. You know, I didn't want revenge as such, but I wanted no longer to be treated like a dog in my own country, in my own city. Didn't want to be treated like a second-class citizen. And this was Ireland, yet it was occupied by Britain. Didn't think I had any right to be here. You know, I wouldn't have, well, Ireland wouldn't have a right to be in Britain, occupying England and London. So it was the same here. For me, my attitude was there shouldn't be any British here whatsoever, you know. When I got out, I got out in 1976. And about eight months later, I was captured in Belfast in a van where a load of bombs and machine guns, myself and five other comrades. But the time in the hit blocks was horrendous. I was there for eight years. I was naked. I was stripped of all my clothes. As soon as I came into reception, the day I was sent, they brought me into reception. So it's like a room like this, six or seven screws waiting for you, were buttons. And the first thing they do is they start ripping all your clothes off till you're naked, trying to humiliate you because you refuse to put on the prison uniform because you're not a criminal. I'm a political prisoner, as I told them, I'm not wearing it. So they just kept beating and beating and beating me, you know. During the hunger strikes, we shot 38 screws dead. And I thought we should have shot more. I wanted as many, up 100, 200 in dead. Even today, I check their names and see who's died, who's died of cancer or whatever. You know, I don't. I hate them so much. They got away, brutalizing us and torturing us for years. Got away with it. They got big bounty money, and they loved doing what they did. You know, and these are war criminals. My 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 father couldn't be broke by anybody or anything. You know, but uh, the sight of me. That's all I broke me out.